Next morning, Bill and Ben peeped into the yard. There were no cars for them, but they didn't mind that. Teasing Gordon would be much better fun. What's that? asked Bill. Shush, whispered Ben. It's Gordon. It looks like Gordon, but it can't be. Gordon never comes on the branch lines. He thinks them vulgar. Gordon pretended he hadn't heard them. If it isn't Gordon, said Ben, it's just a pile of old iron, which we'd better take to the scrapyard. No, Bill, this lot's useless for scrap. We'll take it to the harbor and dump it in the sea. Gordon was alarmed. I am Gordon. Stop! Stop! When Boko suddenly arrived, Gordon thought him the most beautiful sight he had ever seen. Boko, my dear engine, save me! Boko quickly sized up the situation and threatened to take away the cars he had brought for Bill and Ben. This made the twins behave at once. Gordon thought Boko was wonderful. Those little demons, how do you do it? Ah, well, said Boko, it's just a knack. Gordon still believes that Boko saved his life, but we know the twins were only teasing, don't we? Bertie the bus was giving some visitors a tour of the island of Soda. It was their last afternoon and Edward was preparing to take them to meet Bill and Ben. He found it hard to start the heavy train. Did you see him straining? asked Henry. Positively painful, remarked James. Just pathetic, grunted Gordon. He should give up and be preserved before it's too late. Shut up, 